What's going on muchachos? I feel like a long time, no see, no vlog, anything like that. Well, I should say like long time no vlog because I haven't vlogged, ooh, I need to pause that. I've been on a Love Island binge. Comment down below, let me know if you guys have watched this show. It's season two. It aired, I think, in like 2020 or something like that. So I'm like really behind on Love Island. So you guys probably have. It's on Netflix if you haven't watched it. But Emilio's over there just on his swingy swing swing. Um, I'm starting this vlog late. It is 2.05. Edom just left to go to Home Depot. Um, to, oh, I have such a headache. So he deep cleaned our bathroom. Love him. Bless him for that. Uh, but he used bleach. Um, and it's like the bleach gives me really, I don't know, I'm really sensitive to cleaners, especially stuff with bleach in it. And so it's giving me a pounding headache. Um, but anyways, um, honestly, we haven't really been doing much. Just been like lazy. I'm still in pajamas, so, <laughs> and it's two o'clock. Um, but yeah, so he ran to Home Depot because today we are finally going to pick up, um, where we left off with the kids' bathroom, which I didn't even show you guys. I didn't even vlog that because Edom did it the day before he went back to work. So I had to like think, because I was like, was Emilio born? And I'm like, yes, wait, he was born. So it's literally, I think it was like the two days or like the day before he had to go back to work, he actually did this in the bathroom. So I'll show you guys. I, I sneaked it on Instagram, so if you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen it, but um, I will just show you guys here. Like I said, I didn't film it or anything like that. No, don't cry, puppy. I'll be right back. I'll be right back, my love. My little love. All right, let's make this quick. So this wall here is what Edom did. It was, you know, just like a plain, plain old wall. And I really wanted to do like some type of accent wall in here for the kids. I don't know, just to like make it, I don't know, something more than just a plain wall, you know? So, um, we did have the walls in here painted when we painted the house. It's the same color as every other room in the house. Um, so anyways, I wanted to do vertical shiplap. I just thought it would be really cute and yeah, that's what we ended up doing. But I do not want it white. I know we have shiplap in the house and I just really wanted like a pop of color. And so Edom really, really wanted like a dark, dark gray. And I just wasn't sure how I was feeling on dark gray. So that's why we never finished this. Um... And it looks fine white, but even if we were gonna leave it white, like we have to cover the holes and like sand some stuff down and then obviously like repaint because you know, um, it's all like dirty and stuff. But um, yeah, so this is what we started. Oh, he also changed out the, um, the baseboards. So the baseboards all looked like this. Like, why does this look so, like look at this you guys from the freaking builders. Like they never like, just like this kind of shit drives me nuts like they just did such a piss poor job with things and it just uh, anyway sorry um also uh -huh, i need to clean this bathroom so please don't look too closely at the dirtiness but yeah so he put in like just like the flat um baseboards and these aren't even baseboards these are actually like wood he used wood for this and we actually want to change out the baseboards in the whole entire house obviously baby i'm coming don't cry that will be very expensive and I feel like that will take a long time to do. So we were like, well, why don't we just test it in the bathroom first? And so that's what we did. But if we do the whole house, I would wanna do like the real baseboards besides the wood. I forget why he didn't do the real baseboards and just did the wood. I don't remember, but um, it does look really good. So anyways though, um, yeah, so that's what we did to the bathroom. So I finally decided on the dark gray color. I agreed with Edom. Um, what baby from the beginning. And I got gold hooks, which came in the mail, which honestly, I don't know where. I think they're in the garage. I'll show you guys later because Emilio's out here and I know he'll cry if I leave. Um, so we're gonna do like a dark, dark gray. We got the paint last week, I think. I think it was last week, but we didn't get like rollers and there was like something else that we needed. And so it was like, great. So we never like actually painted it, but Adam was like, you know what? I really want to get started on this project. So, and like just finish it. So that is our goal over the next two days. So he's at Home Depot getting the rollers and a couple other things that he needed and he'll like cover the holes 
sand it and prime it and then tomorrow he will paint it. So I'm very excited and we do like the hooks but we want to put up the hooks next to the dark gray to see if we really like it. And then I'm also thinking too, which I think once I see that done I'll like have a better idea. Um, but I, w I don't know, I kind of wanted to like gold and black. So I don't know if I want to change like eventually I will want to but not right now. But like the towel rack if I want to do it gold or black. So once it's done, you guys will have to comment down below and let me know. I want to get like a cute little light fixture for the kids. I'm thinking about framing the mirror. So instead of changing the mirror, just framing it with wood. Um, and yeah, I might even try to change like the handles on the, um, the door. Oh my love, what is it? What's the matter? What is it? Oh, don't you cry. No, papas. No crying. Oh, no, 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 no cry. No, 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 no cry. Yeah, what you said? You said, Mom, you give me attention all day, every day, and then you stopped. For two seconds, you stopped. Oh, my gosh. Is this better? Is this better? Is this what you needed? Yeah, that's what you needed. Huh? Huh, my handsome boy, my handsome boy. What? What you said? Who's handsome? <laughs> oh yes, you are. You are. Are you hungry? I don't think you're hungry. But yeah, so we are gonna be working on that. I should say Edom is gonna be working on that. Um, and that's pretty much it. Alondra's obviously. What? What? You don't want me to vlog? All right, let me see what my little man needs because he obviously needs something and um, I'll check in later. Okay, I want to show you guys some of the stuff that I got for the bathroom. Also, if you guys have good ideas, like if you're good with decorating, comment down below and let me know because the bathroom, I don't want it to be too girly, too boyish, too baby because like obviously that's going to be... Emilio and Alondra's bathroom like he's not using it now, but eventually it will and Also, it's the guest bathroom. So I don't want it to be like too kitty, but like also I don't want it to be too grown so I don't know but I kind of really love like the black and gold idea so um, Anyways, but these are the hooks that I got I thought they were really cute. I really like the wired look so I hope it'll look good um on like the shiplap so we'll see if not it's amazon i can always return it not a big deal but you get five of them i think i'm only going to use three of them or maybe four maybe i'll do three that way i can use two elsewhere so i don't know um but yeah so these are the hooks i will link them in the description box again they are from Amazon so if you're interested this is also from Amazon I bought this literally months like months and months and months ago Alondra hates it I love it um I don't know why she hates them so much but she absolutely hates it um I, I maybe she just like doesn't get it I don't know but let me let's see if I can do this one-handed probably not uh, all right that is better but here it is so it just says get naked and like wired like like wiring I don't know I think it's so funny and like perfect for a bathroom but Alondra's like ew why do you want people to get naked and it's like no like not like naked but you know like it's a bathroom so like when you get in the shower you get naked and she's like that's weird so she hates it but I thought it was cute and like I don't know quirky I don't know if quirky is a word so I can't return it um to Amazon anymore because it's past the like return deadline so I'm keeping it but I was thinking of putting this above the shiplap but if she genuinely just like absolutely hates it I guess I'll just use it for my bathroom but I don't know I thought like the get naked would be cute for like a kid's bathroom slash guest bathroom I don't know what are your thoughts if she really 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 hates it should I just put it in my bathroom I I like it. I thought it was cute. So anyways, these are the two things I have for the bathroom and obviously I have to keep this um, and the hooks are still undecided. Um, so anyways, yeah, but I obviously I need to get new floor mats and things like that. Um, but all in due time. But this is at least what I have for now. Look who's home. Sissy, 
handsome. She's already telling brother stories. So I went to school. <laughs> Emilio loves his sister so, so much. Um, it's a couple hours later. It's four o'clock now. Idam just left to, dang, the water is still not boiled, which is fine. Um, he left to go get some spaghetti because it is a late night for us. Monday is late nights for us because Alondra does have dance. She has jazz I, eyelash. She just went into my eye. And she doesn't finish class until 7.30. So, unfortunately it's a late night. So, just trying to do like a quick, easy dinner. So, spaghetti and meatballs, it is. Of course, we have everything but the spaghetti noodles. So, he is an angel and going to Wally World to go and get that. And then he did start the bathroom, except he just like started like covering up the holes. So there's really not much to show. Man, that eyelash is really all up in my eyeball. Um, so uh, yeah, that's pretty much all we have tonight. Oh, we do have to deliver, we have to deliver those two cookie orders. I don't think she's listening to me, but we do have two cookie orders to deliver and I have them ready to go. I, yes, I have them ready to go. If you didn't know, it's Girl Scout cookie season. And we got all the cookies lined up here. I mean, honestly though, this is not bad. Like, we are running really low on a lot of them. And I've gotten orders twice. I got our first like shipment, and then I got a second one. And I just put in for a third one that I don't get to pick up until Thursday or Friday. But yeah, so Girl Scout cookies are here. Like, look, we only have two Thin Mints. I do need to pack up some cookies because I want to bring them to dance. Just in case anybody wants to buy some at dance, you know, trying to selly, sell, sell. Because this year it's going to be so hard with selling Girl Scout cookies. I know like the past years I would always just put like online that, you know, we're selling Girl Scout cookies. You guys can order online and then it ships to you. This year Girl Scouts is not offering that. My voice just cracked. Um, but yeah, they're not offering that. Like something with the warehouses, like something's going on. And so that won't be offered until February 27th. Um, so I don't know. I don't know if it's the same because there's like two different bakers in the Girl Scout cookie world. Ours is the little, the little brownie baker. So for that one, I don't know if it's the same for both. So not sure. But in case anybody was wondering why I haven't been posting about Girl Scout cookies, that is why. So go get you some Girl Scout cookies um, if you see them. So we actually did two booths. Off. Uh, I guess three. We did one at our house. And then we did two. We did one on Wednesday last week, one on Saturday. And then we have three this week. We were supposed to have four this week, but our chiropractor actually had a baby um, and we were gonna do it at the chiropractor's office. So we're gonna just do that one a different week. So instead this week we have three, which is still a lot. Also my mom comes this week. Um, she comes to town Thursday. We just we kind of got like a, a busy week going on. Um, so. Anyways, so yeah, we do have to deliver two cookie orders before we um, go to dance. So it's kind of like the plan, kind of like what we have going on today. Not too, too much, I guess. Well, I say not too much, but probably for some of y'all that might be a lot. <laughs> um, but anyways, though, now that she's home, I'm going to go ahead and empty out her backpack because as soon as she comes home, I like to go through her backpack and see what's going on. Those two, look at you guys cuddling. Look at my two babies. Just make sure he doesn't lean over too much. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Why are you gonna cry now? Why are you gonna cry now? I know. My cuties. Watch this, watch this. My babies. What do you wanna show me? Ready? Yeah, show me. Just uh, careful. True monster, get ready. Oh, is he sucking on your cheeks? <laughs> are you sucking on Sissy's cheeks? Oh yeah. Oh, cuddle are you cuddling her? Oh my babies. Oh my gosh. You love it. You get Sissy. But all right, I just wanted to check in because you know I've been been editing and I've noticed like with my editing like or that while I've been editing that I've been really bad with like checking in and ending vlogs. So. My bad, y'all. I'm gonna try to be better. I honestly have kind of stopped vlogging just because I am so behind. Like, I'm still uploading December vlogs. So I was like, let me like not keep vlogging every day or vlog a lot because then I feel like I'm gonna still have like January vlogs uploading in March. So I just kind of like put a little pause so that way I can kind of like be up to date. 
But I will tell you the truth too, not a lot has been going on. Nothing like, I don't know. I mean, I mean not, I want to say amazing, you know what I mean? But like nothing, I don't know. It's just been like our normal day to day life. You know what I mean? So like you guys haven't missed much or really missed anything. So anyways, would you say burp rag, burp rag? Okay, someone threw up. So I'm gonna go clean up my baby because obviously he just spit up and then I'm gonna go ahead and get started on cooking the meatballs for dinner. All right, dinner is served. This fancy spaghetti from what's scratch, this, the this? noodles from scratch, the cheese sticks from scratch. Just like Nona used to make it. Yep, just like Nona. Mmm, <coughs> so you can't even can't see the good part. Oh, so good. I know. I am you even just, made the mozzarella, right? I am Chef Boy, our girl. Or no wait, did it. Chef Girl RD. That's what I meant. She's not Chef. You are <laughs> I meant Chef Girl RD, not Chef Boy or Girl. Anyways, yes, baby. By the way, they're lying. We're lying? Yeah, they bought the spaghetti and then boiled it. They bought the sauce, then boiled it. They bought the cheese stick, then they cooked it. But it still tastes good, right? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Anyways, we're gonna eat. Then we gotta deliver cookies and then cappers. get ready for Snitch. dance. Did you just say cappers? <laughs> oh my god, her Snitch. and this like, as she's so Snitch funny, the stuff Snitch's that she girlfriend. says. Ooh, daddy called you a snitch. You rat. It's getting harsh out here. He's roasting you, girl. You rat. All right, time to deliver those cookies. You got both bags. Yep, you ready? Yep. <laughs> you look so cute, my little girl scout. It is the next day and I'm just going to continue on to the vlog. However, it's probably gonna be a boring day. Um, unfortunately, my love was not feeling good. So we got home from delivering. I feel like the lighting is terrible. I need to like, here maybe? Um, but yeah, we got home from delivering the cookies. We weren't even really gone that long. And then you know, I'm just was like, he did not look good and I was like, are you okay? He's like, I just do not feel good. And so I ended up taking the kids to dance and he stayed home. He was having like the chills, but you never had a fever, right baby? That I know of. Yeah, yeah, I mean the highest, I tested it last night, or tested it, I like did his um, temperature. And the highest that reading that I got was 99.3. So I don't know if that's considered like low grade fever maybe, but he had the chills all night. He actually ended up sleeping on the couch because he didn't want to like get in bed with me and Emilio, like just in case. So yeah, poor thing, like just was not feeling good. He was just like down. And then today he wasn't really feeling so good either, but you're feeling a little bit better, right baby? You just feel weak, you said? I feel very weak. Yeah, he just feels really weak. And of course he's in the kitchen cooking and I told him don't even worry about it but he really wants soup and so I don't know I've like I feel all guilty that what are you crying about papa that he's cooking but also I'm excited about what he's cooking so and what are you doing do you want to tell the muchachos what you did huh what what are you making noises for what you want to tell muchachos what you did oh 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 uh-oh, uh-oh. So he, which I don't know if you guys can tell, I have like cleaner on the floor, but I had him in his jumper, which I love this jumper by the way. It's like the baby Einstein one. I got a really good price on it um, for Christmas time. But he was in it, chilling, not complaining, nothing, and I could like smell poop. So I was like, ooh, I need to change his diaper. So I pick him up. And I'm so sad. We ended up throwing away the um, outfit. It was a Valentine's outfit. Sorry, mom, because my mom got it for him. And it's his first time wearing it, but literally there was like, this is the worst explosion we've ever, ever had. We've had several poopy explosions with Emilio. This is by far the worst. It was all down both legs, the poop, all down both legs and all up his back. Yeah, we definitely had to give him a bath, but uh, you're laughing? You think that's funny? You think that's funny? That is not funny. That is not funny. You know. No, Cochino. So, from it like going all the way down his back, we had like a huge old shit stain, poop stain on the carpet. So, trying to get that out, 
uh, it's not really coming out. I'm using like this, I mean, this is a great stain remover, this grandma's. So I love this on clothes. It works great on clothes. Like Alondra has had like some stains on her clothes for I feel like a while and this actually took it out. Um, but it's not taking out the poop. So if you guys have good ideas, let me know. I'm gonna try OxyClean here in a little bit and see if that will help. But what I feel like my eyes just aren't looking correctly, but I've checked the baby Einstein and there's no poop on this. So how is there no poop on this, but there's poop on the carpet? IDK might be a hook gel. Like, I, I do not know. I mean, I feel like I'm just like missing it, but there's, <laughs> I'm all smelling it. I, there, there's nothing, so I don't know. Um, but anyways, yeah, honestly, I haven't really done much. I just got done putting away all of the clothes. Um, and just, I think that's it. Uh, have we done anything? I don't think we've done anything, to be honest. So, um, anyways, uh, I just wanted to check in, I guess, start today or continue the vlog onto today because um, I just completely stopped vlogging. But my, my po oh, you forgot your banana. Here, here's your banana, baby. There you go, papas. But my poor honey bunny just was not feeling good. And he's usually the one that like never gets sick. It could be all of us sick in the house. I'd walk away and he cries. He could be like, all of us could be sick in the house and he could be the one that does not get sick somehow. So it's like just weird because he's never sick. Is he, allergies, yes, but never, hardly ever sick. I'm coming. All right, you guys, I'm gonna stop talking because my baby wants me. We are home from tap and we got to see alondra's um costume it was so freaking cute she's in the shower right now i'm actually gonna jump in the shower too because emilio fell asleep in the car i'm just trying to get everything ready for school tomorrow tomorrow is dressed like a zoo animal oh my god i saw this um as like a reel or a facebook story i don't know one of those little like they're like TikToks, but I don't have TikTok. So anyways, it was hilarious. It was this dad talking about like, why do we buy school clothes for kids? Because like every damn day is a dress up day at school. And he was like, I feel like I'm a secondhand um, spirit store. And I was dying laughing because that's literally how I feel. Like every single week, sometimes twice a week, she has a dress up day. And it's just kind of like, what the hell and of course she loves to do every single dress up day so tomorrow is dress up like a zoo animal and so uh she was like i think i want to be a flamingo and i was like how are you gonna do that and she's like i don't know we're all pink and i had already looked at the calendar because we got like a monthly calendar so we can kind of like pre-plan everything and i was like well i had in mind you would wear your leopard dress and then black pants underneath and you can just wear your black boots and she's like that's a great idea i was like Okay, perfect. Because I was like, I don't think you have... She's got a lot of, like, pink tops, but she doesn't have pink bottoms, you know? So, perfect. A little leopard dress action. So, I just got everything set aside, and then I put her sneakers and her backpack with socks. So, that way she can change her shoes for um, PE. Because the PE teacher got real serious about, like, the kids wearing... Oh, shh. Sorry, Emilio's asleep. But, um... Yeah, the PE teacher sent out like a message being like, like boots, Crocs, things like that are like not acceptable for PE. And like, if they're gonna wear that to school, that's fine, but they need to bring athletic shoes to wear for PE. And so I was like, oh snap. We got a new PE coach um, this year and Alondra loves him. She says he's really cool. So um, anyways, don't want her to get in trouble about not wearing the proper, do your men, do you find random shit in your dryer or washer because of the men in your life? Let me know. I always find something. This is a good paper clip. I'm actually going to keep it. But look, actually, this is my little stash of things. So this I found in his pocket and also a penny. Too bad it wasn't like $20. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead. Restart. You <gasps> Jesus, you're scared. <laughs> what you you're scared the shit out of me. A paper clip. You said you're gonna keep it what? Because it looks like a really good, like durable paper clip. You need paper clips, honey. And then I found this in your pocket and I found a penny. <laughs> you scared the crap out of me. Jeez. 
And that's when I remember to take the trash out of my shorts of all the shit I find at the airport. You, there's it's always random shit. And well, it's because when the planes are gonna come in, you have yeah, to pick up all you the pick trash. up all the fod. So that's why he always has random shit in his pockets. But yeah, I'm just gonna restart the dryer one more time for your work clothes, love. So, all right. Anyways, I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna restart the dryer for his work clothes because he goes to work tomorrow. Mm -hmm. um, and then I am going to hop in the shower. Because you know, well, we got a shower. <laughs> Hello. Hello. How was Tap? Good. Good? <laughs> you loving Tap, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. Especially my brother. I know. You love your brother. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Best of friends, huh? Yes. Well, way. we are just going to have some family cuddles. It's like 7.30 or almost 7.30. Mm -hmm. So we got an hour before Alondra has to go night nights. So we are finally... I know, I see him. Oh. We're finally going to watch Wednesday. We've only watched two episodes of Wednesday. So we're going to watch season three. That's the only thing we're going to have time you for. You mean episode three, not season oh. three? Thank you. Thank you. By the way, yes. guys, they're making episode a season three. two. Yeah, they're making a season two, Alondra says. So, hopefully we like season one. But um, anyways, yeah, I'm going to zip it so we can have some family cuddles and watch some Wednesday. I love you. I love you. I love you. Look at that. It's Yay. snowy. <laughs> oh, my God. Stand back, so though. Crazy. Your hair's wet. I know. Your Look hair's wet, and she's in a tank top and shorts, <laughs> and her hair is wet. Look at that. It's Look at Wiggles. Snowy. Wiggles is like, hell no. I am not going outside. <gasps> Oh my god. I honestly didn't think it was going to snow though. Do you think it's going to stick? No, it's way too wet. I was going to say it looks pretty like wet. All right, even chachos, we are going to go ahead and the vlog here. So proud of my mom. My hair looks crazy. Whatever. Um, I feel like it always does. But anyways, going to end the vlog. Proud of myself because I've been noticing while editing some older vlogs that I've not been ending the vlogs at all. So going to wrap this one up here. I really hope the snow sticks, but I highly doubt that it will because it looks like really wet. But it's still exciting to get snow. Um, just hopefully no problems, no pipes freezing, anything like that because, you know, Texas just cannot, oh my God, my hair. I, you know who I look like with my hair like this? I look like Mary <laughs> for Hocus Pocus, don't I? What do you think of Wednesday? I loved it. I already know who the monster is. Yeah, Alondra's been like watching all of the spoilers, so she pretty much knows a lot that happens, but um, I didn't realize it was only eight episodes in the season. Which is eight hours. Which is, yeah, if they, are, oh, that just scared me. <laughs> it's a, a clip of worst roommate ever, and it's like a guy creepily peeking through the, you know what it reminds me of? What not, um, what is it? Uh, the shiny, when he's like, Here's Johnny! Like, that's what that kind of looks like. Anyways, all right, I'm rambling. We need to end the vlog. Do you want to help me, my friend? Oh, yeah! Yeah. Oh, also, if you're wondering what happened to my Band-Aid, not, not trying to flick you guys off, even though I just did, I was putting away clothes um, earlier, and I don't even know how I did this, but I was shoving my, my chonies, my, like, underwears in the drawer, <laughs> and I was pushing the door to, like, close it, and I caught my finger, and I, like, yanked it out. And so what I ripped skating? the skin off. Yeah, it hurt like hell. What I ripped my skating? skin off, and it was, like, gushing blood. So I was like, <laughs> didn't lose a nail, though. That's like, good. Unlike my, my toenail that I lost. This is my what was that, yeah. four years ago? <laughs> oh, what is it, Papas? What is it? Okay, someone's happy now. Mm. Are you happy? Yeah? Yes, you're like, hey guys, don't forget about me. So we're gonna end it here. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. Please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye, muchachos. Stay warm. Say bye. Say stay warm. Yes. Oh my gosh. Yes.